Wow. I just heard something that is uh, kind of an exclusive, a big time exclusive, it turns out to be true. I can't 100% verify, I'm making phone calls right now, but uh, one source who is close to Ron Paul's campaign, um, delegate to the Republican National Convention, a Liberty delegate, so he's got some connections uh, within that community. There's a big conference call tonight with uh, about Ron Paul and what the future of his movement is. Uh, I want to read it off to everyone and, and, and make sure everyone calls in and participates in this conference call tonight. This is Sunday night tonight. Uh, the phone number is 530-881-1000. Uh, the access code to get in is 890562. Uh, it's at 11 p.m. Eastern Time. I think we'll, we might have a lot more information. All right, so I just got a phone call uh, from a source that I actually trust. Uh, it's not backed up by a second source, so I can't say you know it's fact or but you know it's speculation. But uh, this person seemed fairly confident that uh, this was what was going to happen, and it might be announced tonight. Probably be announced on Tuesday night on the Jay Leno show. Um, how about this, Gary Johnson for president, vice president? On the libertarian ticket, Ron Paul. Think about that. That 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 apparently, and I, and again, I'm not, I'm going to say I don't I don't know any more than you folks do, but I got a phone call, and that's what the phone call told me. They told me for a fact that that was the deal that has been struck between Gary Johnson and Ron Paul. Gary Johnson's going to be the top of the ticket and debating joe biden and uh, paul ryan will be ron paul in the vice presidential debates because how can they keep out ron paul and gary johnson as a ticket together think about that think about how much money will be raised in the next few weeks if this is indeed true i, I i'm praying it's true i was just hoping that uh, ron paul would endorse gary johnson that's what i was really hoping um this would be one better i i i'll be shocked if it's true but uh Looking at things, yeah, it's a good possibility. I, I, I could see Judge Jim Gray, who's a good man, who's been on my uh, radio show several times, stepping aside for Ron Paul. I could definitely see that happening. If that's the case, man, th this is going to be quite the election. Let's let's pray that it's true. I'm going to be praying tonight. Um, 11 p.m. Eastern Time, I'll be on that conference call. I'll have more information. If anyone uh, wants to participate, definitely call in the number again. 530-881-1000, area code 890562, 11 p.m. Eastern Time, conference call about the future uh, of, you know, the campaign for Ron Paul. You know, it seems it seems to be over, but uh, maybe it's not. Tuesday night, Ron Paul, Jay Leno, definitely watching that. Um, very excited that uh, Judge Jim Gray is coming to the Boston Freedom Rally. Either way, that's uh, less than two weeks away. September 15th, Boston Commons. See you there. I will be speaking. I cannot wait. This is quite the election season that we're having. This is, uh, I don't think people realize if you're still out there and you're saying you're not going to vote, you better vote. We haven't had options like this in a long time. Jill Stein, Gary Johnson, Vermin Supreme, Ron Paul, whether you write these people in or you vote for them, Roseanne Barr, I I'm with all, you know, Buddy Romer. There's so many good quality candidates to vote for president you don't have to vote for the two parties do not vote for them vote for somebody else if you if you're not happy with any of the ones i listed vote none of the above because this is what's exciting is that people are actually getting active outside the two-party system and uh... That, that's something that they can't deal with they can deal with you not voting and you staying home what they can't deal with is you showing up and voting for one of those people i said or writing in a name or writing in none of the above, vote for Mike Cann, I don't care. I'm not officially running, but if you vote for me, hey, that's a better vote than Obama and Romney. So, very exciting time. Hopefully we get this news, because if we do, it's going to shake up the world, and we all know that. So, uh, keep your fingers crossed like I am. Do some prayers tonight, and uh, hopefully we get the news that we've been waiting for. Gary Johnson, 2012.